to Vakutva. Now, I take this opportunity to invite the man whose value is not measured by what he has accomplished, but by the works he is undertaking with this team to take Vedic to greater heights. Good evening to one and all present here. The mark of a true host is that they believe in giving the very best of themselves to the guests. Honored guests, esteem management, parents, colleagues, and my beloved children. Today is a milestone day in the annals of our school, Vedic Vidyashram, Tachandala, as we are celebrating the 12th annual day. We have been through various upheavals and a pandemic, and we have come out strong. The honor of presenting the welcome address on this momentous occasion is a privilege that I, as the host, hold very close to my heart and hope that I would do justice to this responsibility bestowed upon me. Our chief guest today is an educator par excellence. She has been a teacher for 28 years, 18 of which she has been a research supervisor. She has published more than 75 pa papers in the field of commerce and has been instrumental in over 100 seminars. She has won numerous awards and is one of the jewels in the Sarda group of institutions. It is with the utmost elation that I welcome our respected chief guest, Dr. Postures, a key thinker with an unsatiable need to provide the latest to the students. His hunger for excellence drives baby to do better in everything he takes up. It is with the most overflowing joy that I would like to extend my welcome to our esteemed correspondent, Mr. T. Duresan. Welcome, sir. She is leading the youngest school among the Vedic family, and under her able guidance, Vedic Valyur has seen a meteoric rise. It is to share in our happiness that she is present here among us. I would like to welcome Mrs. Sahaya Anupalimala, Principal Vedic Vidyashram Senior Secondary School, Valyur. Welcome, ma'am. I would like to extend my welcome to Mr. Madan, Evo Vedic Madurai, Mr. Maharajan, Evo Vedic Valyu, and our own Evo, Mr. B. Krishnan. They are the righteous supports of the respective principles in getting the school to run like a well-oiled mission. Welcome, sirs. Dear parents, you are the reason that we have got these children here to guide them to their better future. Without your wholehearted support, we can neither nurture them nor bring out their full potential. I would like to welcome all the parents here to this wonderful location. Welcome, my dear parents. My dear colleagues, you are the strength and soul of this institution. It is your efforts that we are able to see here today. I would like to welcome all my dearest colleagues to this momentous occasion. My beloved children, the lifeblood of baby. You are the reason for all the praise that is garnered and all the joys of this table of learning. We are here to see your efforts and all your talents. I would like to welcome all my children to this joyous occasion. Imploring God Almighty for his blessings and welcoming you all to this wonderful occasion. I would like to now move on to the school annual report. This is the school annual report for the years 22 to 24. It is my proud privilege to present before you a brief report of our school for the academic years 22 through 24. We have more than 1,000 students on roll at the moment. The children coming in in all happiness and gaiety. We always stand for the best quality education to the common folk. The character formation in the children and their personality development are in two aspects that we aim with the academic